Hey guys, so I'm here doing another vid. Um, you know, like I said, we're gonna try to get these Pokemon videos out every week. And as you guys can see, my opponent Ryan here has has legendaries, all legendaries. Like I, I, I you get sad to see this. Like, you get, I, I mean, just. The, I've ran into so many legendaries whenever I randomly battle someone, and it's getting to the point where I about have to get into a private battle to get a good match. So of course he goes for uh, I can't pronounce his name, but uh, Zekrom. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so I got my glide score, my scummery out, and I mean I just I don't know. He went for fly. I don't know who would teach who would teach him a move like fly. I guess I mean it could be useful in some instances, but this just doesn't seem like one of them. And of course, he uses fly as well. I, I'm, I don't know. It. This is already looking bad. I mean, he clearly. I, I feel like I don't want to insult anybody, but I feel like he didn't. He didn't plan this out really good. Like the fly double fly is not really a very useful technique, if you ask me. So I go for the U-turn. I want to switch and get something in that can probably do a little bit better damage on him. And uh, Garchomp. Don't question it. I went for Garchomp. Of course, he goes for the fly on the Scummery. And, yeah. Uh, Scummery's red card is going to kick him out. Uh, reason being is because I, I, want him, I want him to jump into the spikes. I want him to keep hitting physically. So he can constantly go into those spikes. I know some of y'all probably feel that's a little cheesy, but, eh, he's using legendaries, okay? I, I feel like I feel like I, get, I should get a pass on this one. And um, I go for the Toxic on him. I'm pretty sure he's gonna fly up again. He's not gonna stay on the ground and try to fight me. He's knowing full well that I'm probably gonna go for an earthquake. He would be stupid if he stayed on the ground. And of course he mega evolves, gets the Y. And uh, I mean, I have no reason to switch out. I'm just gonna stick this out and see what happens. I'm gonna go for my mega. And no, as you guys know, I don't, I don't EV train like I should. I'm trying to get into it, but you know, I'm hoping for the best at this point. And um, you know, he hits him. Garchomp takes that. Uh, not, you know, it's not very effective. He goes for the side strike. That's not gonna be very effective, or is it? No, it's not. It's not gonna be very effective. So, yeah, it's earthquake. I mean, why not, right? Get a little damage off, hit both of them. At this point, there's like nothing really he can do to stop me as far as. I mean, other than get rid of Garchomp, he really doesn't have many options. And I'm just gonna continue to set up Stealth Rocks. I mean, get as many hazards up as possible. Uh, he has legends. I want to do as much damage as I can before they get chance to fight, fight. And um, so yeah, I mean, this is pretty straightforward. He goes for the Aurora Spear. Of course, Summary does not take that well. I mean, you know, he's not very specially defensive. And I'm just gonna sit back and earthquake and try to damage his whole team. And get lucky, both of them think from that, which I didn't, I kind of expected to take out Zekron, but not the uh, Mewtwo. So, right now it's looking like it's like 3 or 1. So, this is, you know, this is definitely in my favor. And, of course, um, he's, yeah, so I'm going to try to, um, you know, why not fly? I'm expecting him to do the, uh, I can't think of the name of the movie. Yeah, there he goes, the Oblivion Wing. I'm thinking he's going to go for my talent flame. He doesn't. He goes for Garchomp, which I thought he was going to leave Garchomp alone because if Garchomp, you know, Garchomp has Earthquake, I thought he was going to figure that. But I go for the Stone Edge. He probably predicted that I have that attack. And so now he's doing everything he can to get rid of him. I'm hoping that Fly will kill him. It did not. It, it did not. Of course, another Oblivion win for me. He's not going to take that well. I mean... Yeah, that, he just didn't take that well. I mean, he, he, he did his job. He knocked out, what, two Pokemon, three Pokemon? He did his job. So I'm going to send in Glide Score. And just going to see what happens. I'll go for the Brave Bird. I'm hoping that my Glide Score and my Talent Flame can outspeed him and keep him from getting another Oblivion Wing out. Luckily, that Brave Bird does it. And, um, yeah, that's game, guys. So, um,. Yeah, if you guys are interested in being in one of my videos, uh, definitely check out my page. Uh, you can email us. We're definitely interested in getting some private matches up. Also, we're still planning to do the tournament, so keep your eyes out on the page on more information for that. Um, this is Grease, and yeah, I'm signing out.